Czech Republic, England. Not competing with the highest determination, but you still have three full points. With four changes to the Scottish draw, two factors on the grey offensive line, are note Ulish and Saka, England's entry was smoother than their competition. At the second minute Shaw poked a beautiful ravine so that Sterling would jump down before sending the ball past the head of Ocklick. Unfortunately, the ball hit the pole. By 12 minutes, the influence of the Gralish was revealed. Captain Aston Villa infiltrated the perimeter before. The left-footed Inferno helped Sterling hit his head close to the Czech Republic. By 26 minutes, Master Harry Kane had a very good chance in the forbidden round after a teammate's crevice, but ended up failing to beat the V-Click defender. The Czech Republic also showed that it was not an easy opponent to bully with successive layoffs. At 28 minutes, Holes made a very intense long shot, forcing Pickford to fly. By 35 minutes, Sosik was close to tying after the end of the draw in a ban on sending the ball off the pole. Within a narrow margin. In the second half, he took the initiative in slowing down the pace of the game, put Henderson in the midfield, and waited for a counter-attack. Despite the team's pressure, Harry Kane had no chance to score his own goal. Meanwhile, the Czechs still lack a mutation in the shootings and close to home, not causing any waves to Pickford's goal. In 86 minutes Henderson celebrates the goal into the Czech Republic in an out-of-position position, but referees pinpointed the ball from Bellingham's foot to his position and did not touch any Czech players, leading to an unaccounted for goal. England held a goal apart until the end of the game and closed the group stage in Vihis in the lead.